Rick, I know that, that obviously a lot of coaches by nature are kind of getting anxious going into big games or, or city games and think about things that could go wrong and how to how to answer that. But when you've got a team going into a game that you know they're going to be able to handle things mentally, that you don't have to worry about that part of it, how much comfort does that give you as a coach? Well, I will tell you, I'm, I, I'm concerned about every game. I think I play every game in my head before we play it, thinking about all the different scenarios that could happen with fouls, this, whatever may happen. I mean, you think about all that stuff because you want to, and I have a great staff that does the same thing. But, uh, you know, I like to think if we, everything goes in and we can play the way we're capable of, there's, we should be able to handle a lot. But I, there's no doubt that Kentucky feels that same way. I mean, they're, I mean, they're still, regardless of what you say, they're a top five team, and I think LSU is a top ten. Five team. I mean, you think about it, they've had a great year. They've been able to kind of stay underneath the radar a little bit, but you watched them. They haven't lost an SEC game. So it wasn't like they lost a game last night because somebody can't play. They lost to a team that arguably is they're in a position to win this league as much as anybody. And, uh, but again, I know John well enough to know that his thoughts are on what he's got to do to get his team better from that game. And we'll do the same thing. And we'll play. And then, we still have how many games after that uh, that we're going to deal with. So uh, it's the next one on the schedule, and we've got to be prepared to do what we've done and what we've always done with our preparation. Uh, Rick, uh, Jordan 